Hello YouTube, I call myself Zondaskind and I like to play Civilization 6 and this is a small recap of a game we did with The Cree. I just wanted to play him because I was inspired by the playlist of Molar Molar. I just played a game where I eliminated the Cree and I love mecha -wops. So I wanted to uh, play a game where I got some mecha -wops. So certainly this, uh, this mecha -wop over here was uh, one of the best ones we got. And there would have been one over here uh, if it were not for a natural disaster. We were playing on Disaster Intensity 3 and the bill was just about to replace it. But we just got our victory, our religious victory. We went for the religion of smoking sheep. Uh, backstory there, we settled on tobacco to get to a pantheon sooner. And had to sheep tiles by the time we got our religion. Um, so, settled on tobacco to get to our pantheon sooner. Honestly, Divine Spark isn't the... Pantheon I would want to have beelined um, with that, but it was the best one available, it was the best one to go for, to go for a religious victory. Uh, of course, Mahabodhi Temple, a very good one to get. When doing that, Muslim, always a good one to get. Um, now, if you look at the map, you might notice that there is this weird configuration where I have a city on Scotland's side of the, uh, the bay, and uh, Scotland has a city on my side of the bay. And that is because... I picked up a settler in the ancient era that was uh, running around uh, unguarded in Scotland's territory, took it all the way down here, and Scotland, halfway through the game, decided that this was the best place to settle a city of theirs. Um, other things to talk about, our religion, um, Divine Spark, as I said, we I took religious community, probably work ethic is just always better, but uh, I want to take it for the variety. Mosques, and pilgrimages and holy order are just a generally good setup for a religion game because you get extra spreads, you get extra faith, and you, your apostles are cheaper to purchase. These are formerly Spanish cities. In my defense, Spain took over Candy um, and then declared on us. So we liberated Candy and then liberated the rest of Spain from Spain. And um, because of that, there was a religious emergency. But more importantly, because I was the Susan of Candy, I got some tasty, tasty relics on this map. Because all natural wonders, apart from Mata de Pila, had not been discovered by us yet. The religious contenders on this map were Brazil with Sikhism, um, the Aztecs with Zoroastrianism, Nubia with Taoism, and uh, Norway with um, Eastern Orthodoxy. But we managed to convert all of them within 162 turns. I believe it registers in the Hall of Fame as 160 or 161 victory. So I'm quite um, content about that. So YouTube, if you like that as well, then you should of course like this video. If you uh, think that this map is far better for, for example, a science victory, I could also very much see that then uh, do of course leave uh, your comment in any case subscribe and ding the bell so you know when the next uh, video or playlist comes out and we will see you then bye bye